For centuries, the Ethiopian Orthodox Church was the southernmost Christian church on the Nile Basin. In the 15th century, all the Christian kingdoms of Nubia were swept away by the Muslims of the north. Only the Ethiopian church survived the burning. Its spiritual leader was an Egyptian appointed by the Alexandria Patriarch. Later, the Ethiopian Orthodoxy chose its own path as well as its spiritual leader. Aside from its singularity, the Ethiopian church has many similarities with other Western churches, like the coexistence of a secular clergy whose ministers should be married, and a regular clergy which bishops come from. As well as its connections with Egypt, the Ethiopian church has ties with the Jewish religion. Everyone believes that King Solomon had a child with the Queen of Sheba and that this child, Menelik, the Lion of Judea, was the founder of the Solomonic dynasty. Other Jewish customs have been preserved, such as circumcision and the Holy Sabbath, Saturday as well as Sunday. <laughs> 